What's the power of the low-tech prop? It reinforces the message, but what else does it do apart from reinforce? It's memorable. I love the idea of the juxtaposition, ladies and gents, of the low-tech prop and the big audience pitch. Let me give you the best one I've ever heard of. A corporate lawyer going in talking about intellectual property and picking up the bottle of Highland Spring that was already in the room and using all the trademarks in the bottle of Highland Spring water to explain why he would be a fantastic intellectual property lawyer for the global business. Do you think he had the attention of the room when everyone else had PowerPoint slides, when everyone else had all sorts of various posh stuff kicking about? I love the idea of a low-tech prop for a high-tech, expensive pitch. And you don't get much better than choosing a bottle of water that's already in the room and using the prop that's already in the room to illustrate your pitch to a client for your clever stuff. And again, it's juxtaposition.